All right, we're gonna do some Let's Play stuff today. WWE SmackDown, shut yo mother bleeping mouth. I don't know if I remember how to play this one. It's been a while. I think the last time I played this was when I reviewed it, and that was a few years back. But we're gonna see what we can do here. We're gonna kick it off with some season mode. New season. And who shall we select? It's gotta be somebody good, somebody tough. And oop, I think I saw who I'm gonna pick. Yeah. Can't go wrong with the F5. Well, unless someone reverses it. Oh, I don't really remember this season mode much. Good evening. Tonight we will witness the first ever World Wrestling Entertainment Draft. Vince McMahon will represent SmackDown and Ric Flair will represent Raw. All right, let's do this. Okay, okay, all right. I get it. Let's go. Please select a brand. Um, Raw? Okay. All right. Since I, Vince McMahon, defeated Ric Flair in the coin toss, the number one pick comes to me. So on behalf of WWE SmackDown, I, Vince McMahon, choose... Brock Lesnar, that's me. Okay. Okay. So one thing that's a little confusing is I picked Brock Lesnar as my wrestler, but they still kind of want you to play the role here of GM, who's Ric Flair. Or I guess even uh, Vince if you pick SmackDown but so number two pick of the WWE draft who on this list is deserving I'm gonna pick someone that I see as a world champion as a future Hall of Famer and one of the best names in the business and that's gonna be Sean Stasiak he's the best Can you imagine if that would have happened? Number two pick, Sean Stasiak. Hey. <laughs> uh, even he's surprised. Holy crap. He's like, I got picked? I thought I was getting fired today. All right, we're going to um, skip this because it's rather repetitive and I want to play. If I can still play, I don't, don't remember the buttons, but let's start the program. And by the way, I'm in a squeaky chair here. So you might hear that once in a while. It might sound like I'm farting, but I'm not. It's the chair. Well, unless I am really farting, then I just blame it on the chair. All right. It's quite the bit of cutscenes in this one. Another cutscene. Good old Vinnie Mac. You finally made it. I can't believe you made me wait. That sounded dirty. So, you think you are the man, huh? Well, I'm the one who let you join this program. And you better listen to what I have to say. As long as you don't bite the hand that feeds you, I will think about giving you a title shot. Now that's all. Go out there and win the, da win the match, damn it. Not for you, but for me. If you want, I can make you the next challenger for the undisputed title. How does that sound to you? Well, duh. That sounds pretty damn good. Why would I not want a title shot? All right. Let's rock this thing. Let's go. All right, let's take a look around. We got this first person free roam. Who the hell is that? Is that Jazz? 
It is jazz. Okay. Action. I have no idea what I just did. I went up to her and X was action and hopefully it's not more cutscenes. Okay. What the hell is going on here? That attire is really, really low resolution, that thing. In a bad mood or something. I had a question about Trish. Are you ignoring me? Okay. I guess we'll ask about Trish. She's a loser. She can't fight. She talks too much. I can't stand her. Don't you think so? Don't talk trash about her. Goddamn right. Oh! Oh, dude! You gonna let her do that? You imagine if one of the divas just cold cocked Brock Lesnar? That's it? No fight? Alright, let's get some souvenirs here. Okay. This is kind of hard to control because it feels like a almost like a first person shooter but it you only control all your movement with the left stick which is kind of difficult. Let's go action here. Okay, what is this? We're going to skip that. That's not us. Brock Lesnar versus Jeff Hardy. Let's do it. Dun 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 I'm watching WrestleMania 17 on one TV and playing Shut Your Mouth on the other, so if you don't hear me for a while, I'm probably getting sidetracked by WrestleMania 17, where right now the right to censor is coming out. And Bull Buchanan at this point had tried to grow his hair out, but he's extremely balding and he looks hilarious. Other than the skipping animations here where a wrestler goes from the stage to the ramp to the ring in a couple seconds, these entrances here actually look rather, rather good. And the character models actually look really good compared to uh, uh, Just Bring It. They were pretty, pretty poor. I really didn't even really want to watch the entrances here, but again, I was getting sidetracked watching WrestleMania. Where Taz is now coming out, and the arena's filling with smoke. Okay, let's see here. Okay, X is our attack button. Old school. Oh. Alright. Oh, and I think... I can't remember. I think Square is... Jeez, this sucks, because I literally just finished playing... Um, WWE 2K14 and on the PS3, which is a very similar controller to the PS2. So my natural instinct is to start hitting shoulder buttons for reverse and hitting square to attack, and it's just uh, it's not turning out too well for me here, but I'll figure it out. Let's get some... Let's get some moves going. What the hell was that? He looked like he was dry humping him. All right. I like how um, <laughs> the king is calling moves before they happen. All I did was lift him on the uh, turnbuckle and he's already said, Superplex! Break those ribs. I really do enjoy the graphics in this game. I think this game looks good. Oh, the phone is blowing up. Oh well, I'm playing. I'm playing a game, people. It's gonna take me probably a, a few matches here to... I forgot you can just spam the hell out of the reversal button and just almost get reversal every time by doing that. You don't have to time it just right like the um, more recent games. 
I keep doing the same moves. This is this is pathetic. Oh, that didn't work out too well. Ooh. Bear hug. Into the sidewalk. All right. And... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. F5. That's all she wrote, baby. remember if this is the one where you can attack after a match. I pressed X, so we'll see. I got such a bad memory with all these these games. Just, yep, this is it. Beat him down. Do it to it, Brock. Jeez. Nothing but air. That's something they need to bring back in the newer games. All oh, right. Sorry, getting sidetracked again. So where can we go from here? Well, let's start the program. Decision. <laughs> All right. Well, let's get going. Backstage yet again. Oh, there's Test. Another Diva. Who is that? Ivory. Okay. All right. So now I'm down here. Some plate glass. Boiler room. Boiler room. Ba boiler room? Stock room. I don't know why the hell I saw boiler room. All right. I hope this is actually leading to something and I'm not just wasting my time, which I think that's exactly what's going on. Okay. Yeah, there's really nothing down here. This is, this is what happens when you uh, play a game that you haven't really played through in many years. You know, even, even when I review it, I'm not playing through it like I did when I first bought the game many years ago. So, somebody dropped their foam finger. Alright, let's just get back to the action. I do rather like the music in these games kind of generic generic wrestling rock I guess is what you could call it a lot of the newer games just have um, a lot of new licensed stuff from uh, usually pop and, and rap and it's cool but you know I like the original stuff better Raven is coming on WrestleMania right now. Raven is coming out to the ring with a shopping cart with like a Frankenstein doll in it. I, I think this is the match. Raven, Big Show, and Kane. Hardcore match. Okay, let's go. Don't hate the play, I hate the game. I 
actually really happy with the way that uh, WWE used Booker T when he came over from WCW. They kind of screwed a lot of the guys. I remember thinking, you know, guys like Buff Bagwell were going to be, you know, long-term. Got, you know, Buff Bagwell, DDP. I thought these guys were going to be around for a while winning big championships and stuff, but a lot of the guys got the shaft. Booker T was actually actually treated pretty good compared to others. Jeez. One thing that I always found weird on on these games was the fact that uh, oh come on, if you wanted to attack, uh, oh please come on, Are you, you serious? Oops, just jack the ref up. Okay, if you wanted to attack a downed opponent, you think you would hit triangle and then triangle to run and then X to attack, but it does a standing attack. So if you want to attack a downed opponent you have to actually triangle square and then x which is kind of a weird combination i'm not sure why that is like that but it's something that was around for a few of the games in the smackdown series all right oops i damn it i meant to t uh pin Oh well. Of course. Of course, right? I can't remember if the shooting star press is in this for uh, Brock or... I don't know if he had done that yet at this point. I know after that one uh, at Wrestlemania it was the last one he ever did, the one where he almost killed himself. I was listening to an interview where he said he didn't feel comfortable doing that move and they told him, hey, go out there, do it. You can do it, man, you got it. Come on, Booker. Man, get some height on that. Sleep! Lightning bolt! Alright. God damn it. Gosh dang you, Booker. Okay, we're on track to hit another F5 here. Oh, I went for the power bomb instead. I forgot that was his alternate finisher here. And awesome, we got a rope break. Yay. And another. Oh, come on. Come on, man. Come on, man. I'm not even sure what difficulty this is on, but it feels a little more difficult than normal. Come on, let's get this, let's get this. Come on. Yeah, what the hell is going on here is right. Oh, got him to submit. All right, sleeper. I, I remembered, I just remembered, I'm pretty sure that you can play with the D-pad in this game. I've been playing with the analog stick, which is which is what most people would do, but I, I find the D-pad a little better. The undisputed champion taker. Did he come here to show off his belt? Two men competing for one belt. So much is going on. 
By God. Two men competing for one belt. All right. Start the program. Start the program. Decision, please. Jeez, what the hell? These guys are all fighting backstage. I don't know what happened. It froze. All right. It's D D P. Let me just let me say just one thing. Why does he get a title shot? What's so special about him? I don't care about the title shot anymore. Okay. DDP wants a piece of Brock Lesnar? Are you kidding me, brother? About to go down. You guys are fighting over here. You got Frito-Lay boxes. They're hitting each other with cones and... Kane just hit Big Show with a piece of wood. It snapped. Raven comes in with a garden hose. He's choking Kane out with a garden hose. This is crazy, man. Raven with his leather shorts on. Jeez. All right. Back to the action. Regaling Kane. Test and book. Brock Lesnar and DTP. <laughs> Big Show just tackled Kane through a door into some kind of locker room. This is too much. This is too much. This is worth. This is worth my nine ninety nine a month. I just sit back and just put this stuff on play in the background while I'm working on videos and just... I'm gonna watch this real... I like DDP's entrance. Got some pyro here. Bam! Yeah! It's kick ass, man. This guy didn't start wrestling until he was like... He was 35 or 36 years old. That's, that's crazy. Sometimes I feel like I'm old. I'm, I'll be 32 here coming up. This guy's just... DDP started wrestling. Okay. Let's see. Can I use... The, okay. I can use the D-pad. This is going to help me a little bit. I forgot that the uh, taunt is... One of the L buttons here. Come on, Earl Hebner, you're getting in the way, man. All right, bam. I like the animation on the moves in these games, the moves that they added for this game. The t man, the timing on the uh, Irish whip grapples are tricky. Seems like every game in the series, they change not every game, but every few games, they change rather drastically. Okay, come on. What is going on? Why is that such a long two count? Yeah, you shut up, uh, JR. You bastard. All right, press slam. Break one of those tables. Maybe not in this match, but. Alright. Well, knee to the face. Knock some teeth out. Actually, heard I heard a long time ago that I think all the DDP's teeth are fake or they're all. Something's up with his teeth. He had a bunch of dental work done. I guess he had really, really bad teeth when he was young, and he said he had like $10,000 worth of dental work done.
All right, Brock Lesnar with the running schoolboy. That's cool. Why did I do it again? Compared to the newer games, I feel like there's not as much for me to do here. There's not as many different grapple positions. There's no against the rope grapples. There's no, you know, lifting a person onto the turnbuckle and then choosing different moves from there or seated grapples. And for the life of me, I still can't pull off a damn Irish whip grapple. Look at this. It's not the game. It's me. I know. All right, come on, get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here with that. Come on, you spamming this move on me, DDP? Come on, take it back to Joyzy. I don't care about the popularity contest, King. Come on, man, I'm just trying to win a match, man. You know, I didn't get the. Oh, that was cool. He's dead. Okay, how do I taunt? There we go. Got me a finisher. Come on, bring it. We're doing it in the middle of the ring. I'm not going down with that uh, rope break crap. Bam! Oh, still going to get a rope break. Get on the what the hell? I get on one side, he still pins him on the other. It worked. All right. Let's see what happens now. Yeah, look how happy he looks. DDP was talking real big. Not looking so good now. Oh yeah, that's a that's an authentic Brock Lesnar taunt. He always gets on the uh, turnbuckle and raises his arms. Well, we're going to go for uh, whatever's next. Start the program. Let's do it. All right, let's get back to where we were. I don't know. I feel like I should be doing something else here. Other than getting dizzy. Oh, come on, Regal. Do you want some problems, man? Let's go. Come on, Chico. Hey, come on, Chico. You want to step in the ring with Brock Lesnar? The next stadium by car. Do you want to ride with me? Think about it. I think he's trying to get it, Brock. He's trying to besmirch Brock Lesnar. All right. Jesus, I don't know where to go. What is this? What the? Oh, locker room. There's gotta be something in the locker room. Brock's just walking around. People are eating there at the the food and beverage area. Brock's walking around backstage and his, with his gear on. Jesus, there's nothing here. Except for a Hulk Still Rules poster. All right. Well, that didn't go as planned. Oh, hi. What does this lead to? What the hell? Can I buy merchandise? Oh, it's the shop zone. I can, I can do stuff here, I think. Let's see, what can I do? Ah. 
win any match in this pay-per-view to unlock Hollywood Hogan. Oh. That I would like t to do. I would definitely like to unlock Hollywood Brother VIP room. Come on, if there ain't nothing cool in the VIP in the VIP room, there ain't nothing cool in the game, period. There's got to be something in here. Got to be something in here. Come on. See? Look. Hey, Brock. What can I do for you? Glad you came by. I wanted to talk to you, too. Yeah, where's my damn title shot? How am I doing right now? I just came by to see how you're doing. No, I want my title shot. I'm too busy to deal with you right now. Ah, well, too bad. I want my title shot. Nope. I want my title shot. I want my title shot. Okay. The WWE can't exist without you. Yet, he doesn't have time for me. For my title shot. No wonder Brock left. Look how he was treated. I'd go try to play football too if I was him. Alright, I guess we're back to the action. Oh, I hate tag matches. Hate them. Absolutely hate tag team matches. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Sometimes in life you don't get a choice. It's just the way the cookie crumbles. It's the way the ball bounces. And uh, everything in between. Dead man walking. It's like an instrumental version of this theme. I can't remember if he actually started with an instrumental version of it or if they just... Dude, he's like having a seizure on the bike. I'd have to say, uh... Undertaker's probably one of the best looking models in the game. I mean, he looks pretty spot on, man. That's... Good job they did. Oh, come on. No ring taunt? Kind of jip. Oh, well. Let's do it to it. Let's crush these guys. What the hell is this? It's like a generic brand Hardy Boy theme. Didn't even notice that before. It's DDP. Oh, who's legal? What the hell's going on here? I guess I'm not legal, judging by how Earl Hebner's dogging on me over here. Yeah, but if I remember correctly. I can get out of the ring and beat the hell out of DDP. Okay. There we go. Come on. Remember how I said I wanted to break a noun stable? I think it's going to happen right here. Yeah. Oh, come on. Come on, man. Come on, DDP, man. You do what I tell you to do, please. Yes! That's what you get. That's what you get, homie! Alright, let's try it again. Just gonna put him through table after table. Not like that, obviously. Oh, whoa! What the hell happened there? Is 
This is a tough table. All right, this will do it. Ah. I should probably be paying attention to this match. I mean, for all I know, Taker could lose it for me in there. All right, this one's got to do it. Let's do it. Oh, Jesus, Brock. All right, sometimes tables just aren't meant to be broken. Yeah, you go back to where you're going, dude. How do I get up here? There we go. No, I just want to get on the apron. Can I get on the apron, please? There we go. All right, come on. Tag me, dude. Tag me. How do I... Some kind of way to ask for a tag. I thought there was. Oh, all right. No, let me out of the ring. Come on, he's gonna pin him. This is why I don't like tag matches, man. This is a... Get out of here, Earl. Steal from the WWE. And get fired. Go work for TNA. Never be the same. And you screwed Bret Hart, damn it. So I don't have any compassion for you, man. Look at that crowd, man. That's that's like back to the, re the WCW Revenge days. Actually, a little better than Revenge, but not by much. I'm beating the hell out of DDP over here. You get a special. Bam. Yes. Uh, I thought he was going for a pin. Oh, awesome. Love when that happens. F5. Backwards, man. The buttons to get out are reversed from the current games. It keeps throwing me off. R1 is is to get out of the ring instead of L1. And it's just throwing me off. All right, we did it. We did it. Brock and Taker. The very guy that would end Taker's streak helped him win. <sighs> Should I attack him or don't do anything? Well, he wouldn't be Brock Lesnar if he just walked away, so let's let's attack him. Well, you know, I'll see you later. Bam! That's right. What a cheap shot. You shut up, King. Your whole career is built on cheap shots.